Hey everyone, what is up? I am going to do this tour of the three star trials for the espers. The goal is to get as many tickets, as many lapis as we possibly can. So we're going to go in here and we're going to check out uh, the third star version trial of the wind sprite, which is the esper tetrasulfid. Um, oh shoot, I have rat tails in my items because I just went back and I did and I grabbed Bahamut. I got him on my team so I could get that, um, you know, 90% blue ticket for, um, for this pull. I want this to be like the, the best, the best time ever. Um, so that's why the rat tail's there, but I don't use items anyway, so it's really not an issue. So we can kind of ignore that. Don't get, don't get nervous about it. Um, I'm going to take these guys in to, to do this trial. And actually, you know what, lately I've been using my good friend, um, Chow. So we're going to go in with good friend Chow because he's fully geared. He's awesome. We like, we like his kit healing magic covering the whole bit. Let's get me some tickets. It's all about the tickets. It's all about the tickets. Okay. Um, I have read this before um, because I didn't realize what I was doing, so I'm going to skip it. I don't want story spoilers for anybody who is not here yet. Um... Okay, okay, okay. So, obviously, we're going to get our Guardian's Blessing. And Esther, you, Shock Embrace, and, no, oh, wait, no, that's not what I want to do. Shock, damn it. Ugh. Not off to a good start here. Shock Embrace, Storm Calling, there we go. Um, these guys are wind, so Rem's here because she can do some quake. She can quake it up. Um, all I am about right now is getting as, as many, as many tickets as we possibly can, as many lapis as we possibly can. Right now, I am at, I think it's 63. Dang it, stop talking! I can't concentrate. Link stance. Okay. Heroic. And. Oops. Do not want enhancing barrier stance, please. Um. Right now we're at about 63? I think it actually is like 6,400 lapis. I don't know that I'm going to be able to actually get up to 10,000 lapis and do two steps. But, but we'll see. I mean, that'd be cool if I did. I do have a lot of story content. I went back today. I don't know if I just went through the right order on any of that. Oh, and I didn't even try to do a break with Lauren. Oh, that's so silly. Um, I, all, you know, all today I went through and I, and I got all the espers because I hadn't done that. There's a lot that I hadn't done. And I realize a lot of the Esper fights, even like um, for for stage two, do give you the rare summon tickets. So I am a ticket collector right now. That's my job, collecting tickets. And so, um, where's General Mofo? What? Oh no, I did. I did use it. Okay, good. Whew. We're there for a second. But now you can Tempest Charge. Um, so yeah, so now I am in a place where, um, I've got, I've got some good resources to, um, towards, towards the baby pool. Baby pool. Mm -mm. I love puns. I love plan words. I have a really cheesy dad, so maybe that's why. And you can so full and impregnable. Thank you. And go 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 go. Um. So yeah, 
doing doing what we can. We're gonna go through as many of these three star fights as I possibly can to get as many tickets as we can. If we if we beat this one, we get a four star ticket. A four star for actually not beating it. What was it? It was like four star uh, ticket if you don't use any items. To me, to me that is a that is awesome. It's one chance. I don't know if any of you all watched my. My poll, um, my original poll on the swimsuit editions, but um, it was really, it was those four star tickets that I got it, you know, anything from. Well, no, I think maybe, well, yeah, yeah. Because I got, um, I got my Citra Folka unit from my four star ticket, my last four star ticket I think that I used. I don't think I got anything on the steps, so. I don't know, is Esther, is she going to be able to do this? Let's get in there kingdom's order, I guess. Because that does some damage. I don't know, I'm just like half-hazardly going at this. I just, yes, I just want some tickets. Give me some tickets. Sorry if this is like coming across extremely violent. I'm not in a violent mood. Okay, sorry, I don't want, I don't want you to experience spoilers. Oh, he smokes. Good. Ticket in my pocket. Moving on. Where are we off to next? Who do we think is doable? Um. Where are we in? Palladia? No, not like that. Was, uh, who do we think is doable? Spoiler alert! Map spoiler alert! Spoiler alert of the map! Um. Should we go back to beginning. Go back to where it all started. Siren, what do you got going on? <sighs> Heal, support, and strike. Uh, stronger, dealing more damage. Boost our spirit, be mindful of the abilities. Odds of winning will become bleak if the enemy successfully... Well, <laughs> we're not worried about that. We will block the ailments because we will bring in Boca. Oh, no limit bursts. Okay, no limit bursts is what we need to do. Point taken. Oops, I did not mean to do that. Oh. So we're gonna switch out Nicole for Foca. We have geared, ready, and all raring to go. Raring to go. Thank you. Um, Ram, probably don't need you anymore. Let's see. Eh, it's just throwing our good friend Barbaricio. Oh, no, I am smarter than that. Sora, I've got you geared for true double hand, and you can chain with Esther, so we need that. Yes, you have my permission. Proceed with the download. I really thought that that like permission thing was going to keep it from keep asking me for permission, but you know what? Um, permission is important, everybody out in the world. Alright, I skipped through the story. For any of you who are not here yet, I don't want any spoilers, however small. I would hate to do that to you. I want you to be able to hang out with no worry of spoilers. I'm here for you, right? Yes. Okay, um, ciao. Guardian's blessing, great move. Folka, you protect us from all those ailments that our Mughal friend so helpfully warned us about. General Manifesto, please. And then, see my move. Is it cheating to go through these with um, Esther? I'd love to hear your thoughts on that. I mean, personally, I don't feel like it is because I'm not very good at utilizing my characters for all their strengths. So I'm I'm okay. I'm okay doing this. All right, ready, set, go. Okay. Huh? We got a four-star ticket, guys. We got a four-star ticket. Today's been a little bit of a doozy, I have to say. 
Um, I was going up to the front front of the house to uh, vacuum up some centipedes. Everywhere I look, I find there are centipedes everywhere I look, and they just keep coming in. And somebody was telling me that they actually they multiply, which I don't know if that's just just hearsay, just a centipede. Um, story so you guys don't see it okay see I'm a friend I didn't want you guys to to have any spoilers but they apparently well I've heard, I've heard that they multiply or, or something like that which I don't know sounds disgusting but they are everywhere and so I went up to the front of the house and I was just gonna like go vacuum up some cat litter that make you know the, the cats go <laughs> Bring it everywhere, and then any any centipede skeletons and whatnot that have been shed behind to multiply into more. Um, kind of sounds like a Final Fantasy boss. Um, anyway, I went up there to do that, and as I was walking up towards the door, this is what I see. Now, my eye has this like sixth sense for irregularities which is why I'm probably a little OCD when it comes to straightening things but I noticed this like right off the cuff and um, wasn't too keen on on what I was seeing so then I went closer and I peered down and I verified that yes it is a very large and disgusting tarantula if anyone would if anyone would like to see it from the other side, I'm going to show you this for two seconds and I'm going to take it down because, yikes. Ready, set, look. Okay. Um, anyway. Yeah, that thing was just hanging out in the front door, which I wasn't a big fan of. So centipedes, tarantulas, this is my life right now. This is why here I am right now getting in at happy hour to get me some four-star tickets for our baby pool baby pool. Love it. Baby pool. Not baby pool. Baby pool. Okay, so one more. Una Moss. Should we go after uh, Shiva? If we can find her little house. I can never find... They, these maps are really tricksy for me to navigate. Where are you, Shiva? You're not there. Oh no, you know what? We know who's there. Gollum. You know what? Let's try him. Oh, but he's difficulty 126. Huh. Well, let's see. Evoke tetrasulfid. Just so happens I have that chick now. Um, no items. Speezy, speezy. Okay. nobody because we've got this right all right last one guys me and you tonight this is the last one we're gonna achieve um also what was I gonna say what did it say oh it didn't say we didn't look we need to look we don't want to be foolish Fornable enemy that is simply very powerful and has very high defense. After it uses its earth wall, it becomes almost impossible to deal damage against it. So you're better off spending your time preparing instead of attacking. Usually target single units. Okay, so bring a tank unit. Gotcha. Alright, cat's going crazy. Cat's getting dropped off tomorrow morning for... Um for another glucose curve. It's 7 a.m. Not excited about that one. Right, we're swapping you out for Wilhelm. Where is Wilhelm? Wilhelm's in another party. Alright. So, I know it says something like, you're going to be in land, you're going to be in your attacks. But let's just try this. I'm going to swap you out back for our... Our favorite marine strategist. Let's just see how this goes. 
If so, this is really just a nod to Esther and her fantabulousness. Should I go back to that picture of the tarantula? Anybody want to see that again? No, me neither. That's odd. Gollum is usually quiet, but I sense him calling out to us. Um, just gotta skip past this for you guys. Don't want to have any spoiler alerts. All right. Um, let's see how this goes. I don't know when exactly some of these three-star Esper battles came out, but I'm pretty sure it was before the seven-star era. So that's why I kind of take everything with a grain of salt. It's kind of like, how do you strike the balance between like my own ineptness when it comes to fighting boss fights and the power of my party and who this boss actually was created for. Um, there's like this, uh, too, too many variables, right? Oh man, Lauren, okay. Try to, try to, try to break this guy. I don't know if it shall work, but we will try. I'm hoping that like the physical thing, physical tax won't matter or whatever. This doesn't apply since we're gonna do this little move that imbues herself with lightning. I feel like that's a good opportunity to show that we are not just any old um, attacker. Hmm. Okay. Fraggle Rock. That was alright. We are fine. Um, now you can do the three time thing. We can really see if we can get that damage going. And you, my friend, can join in. Actually, you want to be the Tempest Flash, because that's actually a better move, I think. I don't know. Someone correct, it. correct me if I'm wrong, please. All I'm asking is that in the comments, be like, Oh, so remember when you did that, and you put those two moves together? That actually was not what you thought it was. That would be pretty helpful. It's kind of crickets in the comments for now. Which, you know... My my thought on, on this whole thing was, like, this excitement about building community, so I'm, I'm really anxious to hear everyone's voice out there. What they like, what they don't like, thoughts on things, etc. Um, I don't have social, like, I'm not on Twitter, I'm not on Instagram. I don't do those things. Um, and I haven't opened up a Discord or anything like that yet, which, I don't know, maybe that's where to go. I watch people on Twitch, but I don't stream anything on Twitch, so... I'm really new to the whole scene. So, um, so yeah, when I say I want to build a community, it's because I don't have a community. So if there's any pe anybody out here that wants to chime in and, and say some interesting things, then I would, I would love it. Because I'm enjoying this. Like I said, I'd rather talk to myself about Final Fantasy than talk to nobody about it. Mm -hmm. That's not embarrassing, is it? Not at all. Great Wall. The Great Wall of Wilhelm. Alright, so I'm not sure how this will work because he's apparently... Um, he's apparently resistant right now to these kinds of attacks, but we'll see. We try. Cat's ready to eat. I don't know if you can hear that, but she is real ready. I don't know. It did work. Well, there you go. Hey, Gollum, you were a formidable foe. FFBE's words, not mine. Um, but we're just going to take our ticket. Thank you. 
take our ticket and run to the baby pool. Actually, we're going to do a few more of these tomorrow. What I'm waiting for is I want to collect the other 5 plus 1 from our daily logins. Okay, shh, don't watch, don't read. Oh, that was cute. You weren't there to watch it with us, but um, hey, if you haven't done this yet, then go enjoy it. Um, yeah, it feels, feels a little cheap with, with Esther, but at the same time, I do need all the help I can get on big boss fights, big boss men, and I need, um, I need those tickets, okay? This is all for your enjoyment. Oh, I didn't use Tetra for the because I don't think anyone's equipped with her. I think she's back at level one, right? Because I just got her three star. Anyhow, we can always go back, but hey, I just got three four star tickets for your benefit. You guys are going to love the baby pool. I think it's going to be better than the original pool because I think we actually have, I think we're going to have more tickets. I've been going nutso trying to rake as many of these up for you guys as I can. So hey, that was fun. Thanks for hanging out. Um, please be ready to cheer me on. That baby pool is coming soon. I'm waiting for the second 5 plus 1 from our daily logins. I have the first one. I'm saving it. I think there might be an EX ticket in the meantime before we get there. So we'll see. And if I can get the lapis up and be able to do two steps, even better. Right now, I think I'm about 6,400 lapis. So um, we, we will do what we can. If we can get it up to 10 by the time we get that 5 plus 1, you know, the uh, the end date, no, it's 6,700, sweet. Um, the end date for, for the pooling is, is June 14th. We're gonna try and do it before then. I can't possibly contain myself any longer. So coming up, guys, it's coming up real soon. Um, it's gonna be fun because you know what? All of these tickets are gonna mean something. This lapis is gonna mean something and I'm going to go through exactly what they mean and what it took to accomplish it. So I want everyone to, to be there be there uh, wishing me the luck. All right. Sweet. Have a good night.